Hello ladies and welcome back to my channel. It is me, Monica. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. So in this video, I'm going to break down how to install your clip-ins to create a ponytail step-by-step. -step. So the first thing you're gonna wanna do is what you see me doing here in this clip. You're going to wanna part out a section all the way around the entirety of your head and I like to leave about two inches of hair out all the way around because my hair isn't very thick and I also have relaxed hair so leaving out more will allow me to cover the clips when I get ready to put the clips in so once you get that pulled out you're gonna simply put your hair up in a ponytail and go ahead and put it in the position of where you want the ponytail to sit because you won't be moving it once it's in place so now what i'll do is take my very first clip and i'm gonna start with the smallest one or the shortest width one and i'm gonna just start placing them on top of the ponytail so I'll clip each clip and I alternate going back and forth from front to back and starting with the small one, I just clip them on and then clip them up into the existing ponytail. One tip is as you're doing this or before you start this, you'll see in this video, my hair is very straight because my hair is short. It would have been easier to blend had I put curls in it before I put the clips in so going forward like if I do this again I'll definitely go ahead and put some curls in my hair just so that it'll be easier to blend to the ponytail um, I will try to fix it at the end but if you do decide to do the style and your hair is short and you're using long clip-ins then it'll be easier to blend it if you add curls to your natural hair first All right, guys, so I have officially put in my last clip. So the pony is doing its thing. But now I'll take my brush and I'll basically brush my hair all the way up, all the way around into the ponytail that I've already created. So I did need to use a little bit of hairspray. Um, I actually use the Kenra, it's number 14, it's the Kenra Platinum 14 working spray. Um, but I did need a little bit of spray to just help hold it up in the back. Cause again, I have that little short hair that I'm trying to grow out. Um, and I also didn't really like super straighten my hair to do this style. I just wanted to do the style. I wasn't doing it to like wear it or to go anywhere, but I just really did it as a tutorial so you guys could see how I made the ponytail. But after some padding and some smoothing, I was able to get it in place. All right, so once the ponytail is up, you can see I got like this little spikiness going on. And of course we don't want a spiky ponytail. So I'm just taking my Babyliss Pro flat iron 
and just bumping the top of it to get it to lay down. Again, had I put curls in it, it would have just naturally curled into the ponytail itself. So take that as a lesson for me. If you ever do this, go ahead and just put a little curl, you know, put a, little, put, put a few curls in there. So clip-ins come with seven pieces and I probably use the five smallest ones. So there's still two pieces of clip-ins that I could have added to this um, ponytail to make it thicker as well as to, um, yeah, to make it thicker. But I don't have a, you know, my head is kind of small. So just, I didn't have a lot of space and Again, this was more for instructional purposes. I wasn't really going to go anywhere and wear this out. It was just um, making content. So for the purpose of instruction, you guys can see how I created the ponytail, but um, you definitely have the option to make it more full with the clip-ins um, on our site, our Lux clip-ins. Uh, I The curling iron I just used for that ponytail was my um, T3, I think it's the name of it. I just got it, y'all. But I'm going to tell y'all, I love that curling iron. It's a one and a quarter inch curling iron. I'll put the link down in the description for everything that I use in this video. But when I say that iron, it's the business. And then um, also I am using our edge control that's on our site, Excellent Edges. And when I say it's the business. I know y'all like, girl, you say everything is a business, but I'm trying to tell y'all if it ain't official and if it ain't legit, it's when it come to my hair, I'll mess with it. And that's for real, for real. But for y'all who know me, even for y'all who don't, y'all keep watching me. Y'all keep rocking with me and y'all will see she don't play around about that hair like at all. All right, ladies, so this was the finished look. Um, I just polished it up a little bit. In real time, it probably took me 10, maybe 15 minutes at the most. But uh, as you can see, I'm having a really good time with my pony. So yeah, if you guys have any questions, any comments, please leave those in the comment section below. Um, like I said, I'll link everything that I use in this video um, in the description down below and thank you guys so much for tuning in please like comment and subscribe and we'll see you next time